first-hand experience. He, he's been through pro basketball. He knows he knows the ins and outs about some things that you should avoid. Dr. Robinson, he's great. I mean, just besides being a basketball player, he knows the professional mind. You all been hit with a DUI. And what we call DUI is destination unknown indefinitely. You guys that are looking for a job, your destination is unknown. This is now your business. What do you want to do when you finish playing? If there's no more basketball, what are you going to do? That's the question. No more sports. I don't just deal with basketball. I deal with football. I deal with baseball. I deal with soccer, track. I just deal with athletes. You say you don't know. So it's okay. Now you go into another phase, another journey, another chapter in terms of you. You are the CEO of you. So guys always tell me, oh, the thing I hear the most is, I want to do my own business. Well, right now you are, you are your own business. You are the CEO of you. Are you ready to work nine to five? No, nobody's ready to do that. These five areas, there's social and behavioral, human resources, political, symbolic, and structure. Don't worry about that, that, that terminology. It's a little bit over my head sometimes. Don't worry about it, because when I give you the examples, you will see them when you go to the next location. From a social component, who you hang with in another country and where you hang out, it's a reflection of the team. Listen, you are not the first American on that team, and you're not going to be the last. Y'all all posting all this crap and all these videos, and the uh, next thing you know, you get one person in the human resource area. Oh, you on, you on Facebook? You Facebook? You Facebook? Yeah, I'm Facebook. Okay, what's your? Oh, yeah. Now, bang. They're like, okay, now let's see what he's been doing. Don't ever say nothing about the team negatively on any of it. You going home. The last thing is, is this going to make you some money? Anything that you do, any, any decision that you make, you, go, you got to figure. If I'm going to go to this club, I'm thinking, yeah, I'm going to go to this club, this, that, and the other. Got a game tomorrow. I got a game tomorrow. But you know what, man, I'm bored. I'm going out. Is this going to make you some money? Because if you go in that place and things don't work out right, maybe a fight, Maybe somebody say something to you, somebody push you, you accidentally talk to somebody's girlfriend and then you don't even know it's in another country, another label. Next thing you know, you got four or five guys jumping on you. It's happened, you won't be the first. So you got to understand that every decision that you make, you have to ask yourself the question, is this going to make me money or is it going to cost me money? Don't let your feelings get in the way of the money. He making money, but he got bills just like everybody else. This bill's just bigger. So, you know, if you got a little apartment and you got to pay your gas and light and electric, he got a big mansion. He got to pay his gas, light and electric. The bigger the house, the more, more bills you got. Guy asks you, man, how much they pay you over there? It's enough. No, no, seriously, seriously, how much they pay you? It's enough. Listen to this. Always think and remember, if they ask you how much money you're making <coughs> and they ask you more than, more than two times, they have to do something. If I knew I could stay here for five years, I could do, I could do this five years. I would go to the people right then and there, halfway through, and be like, man, you know, let's negotiate a contract for next year. See where their head is. Once you get all the other parts of the human resources, once you got them feeling comfortable with you, say, man, I love it here. I love it. Let's, let, let, and they say, oh, you want to sign the same money? Same money. Give me the same money. And you may think, oh, man, I'm going to sell myself. So don't let your feelings get in the way. As we said before, this is now your business. What are you going to do?